Hello and good morning, my friends. As promised, we are going to continue talking about faith, particularly faith as we read about it in the book of Hebrews. The verse I shared with you last week spoke to my heart, so much so that I have decided to dedicate the next six weeks leading right up to Christmas Day, sharing stories about members of the Hall of Faith. So over the next six weeks, we are going to talk about Abel, Noah, Abraham, Sarah, Elizabeth, and last but not least, Mary. It is my hope that their stories of faith can be used to our benefit. So when the rain comes and the ground beneath us feels unsteady, we can remember how they handled their lives and their journeys of faith and apply the lessons to our own lives. Really looking forward to this next six weeks. I'm gonna share some more words of wisdom from the book of Hebrews. This time, chapter 11, verses 13 through 16. And again, this is the message translation. Each one of these people of faith died not yet having in hand what was promised, but still believing. How did they do it? They saw it way off in the distance, waved their greeting, and accepted the fact that they were transients in this world. People who live this way make it plain that they are looking for their true home. If they were homesick for the old country, they could have gone back any time they wanted. But they were after a far better country than that, heaven country. Y'all, this is probably the hardest thing we will ever have to do. Be in a situation we, when we are in the waiting rooms of life, praying desperately for something, either to be healed from an illness or for a loved one to be kept safe. Any number of things we may be praying for and holding close to our heart and humbly giving these requests to God. It may be the hardest thing we ever have to do to see the reality, see the gift far off in the distance and not be upset that we don't have it yet, but to instead wave to what we hope to receive off in the distance and have faith that we will one day get it. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Over the next six weeks, we will talk about how these various six members of the Hall of Faith did exactly that and died not yet receiving what they asked for, but still holding so steadfast to their faith. This is going to be a good six weeks coming up. I look forward to seeing you same time, same place next week when we can all learn about Abel. Much love and blessings to you, my friends, and have a great week. Thank you.